Okay, now let's have a look of the text of speech section. Text of speech section, okay. Well, if everything will go well, go right, you will find automatically the text to speech language set to the language, to the default language of your smartphone. In this case, I put English USA, okay. And uh, if something will go wrong uh, really bad, you will find at the beginning of the options section a yellow message saying that there are problems with the current language or with the current text-to-speech engine and you have uh, to change it or to find uh, the problem. Uh, it's not easy for beginners people but uh, that's what not can happen so I will I am warning you that uh, if you have problem with that uh, uh, call assistance <laughs> to more expert people because the problem is not easy. Well, uh, if everything is correct, uh, from here you can change uh, the language. Anyway, to have a look. Okay, this is the solution. Free notifications reader. Okay, <laughs> just uh, a joke. I will uh, change it uh, in, uh, for example, Japanese. Free notifications reader. <laughs> okay, uh, let's go back to English USA. Okay, English in the United States. Okay. Free notifications reader. Okay, the second option, text to speech setting. This is the normal text to speech setting page in which you can select the text to speech engine. In this case, I always suggest the Google text to speech engine that is good, uh, is free. So it's really okay from this point of view. From here you can change something such as the speech rate. That's, uh, this is funny also. Let's have a look about that. Oh, excuse me. Well. Free notifications reader. <laughs> okay, really <laughs> too much. Speedy. Well, okay. Well, excuse me again. Well, free notifications reader. Okay, really better. Then the third option you can force eventually a text to speech engine. Default will go to the default text to speech engine uh, that's set by the system. Otherwise, if more than one engine is present, you can you can check another one. Well. And vocalizing lowest case, it's interesting. I will always put it on because uh, most of uh, text to speech engines, if uh, they find uh, a, a word in all capital, uh, they will spell it letter by letter, really boring. So if you put it uh, this option on vocalizing lowest case, the text is always converted in lowercase, so this will not. Okay.